What's up everyone? Today I'm going to show you how to light up your PC. In light, I mean installing LEDs, specifically RGB LEDs. So, first step is to lay your computer on its side, unplugging every cable, definitely the power cable, then removing the two thumb screws that hold the case together. Now, installing RGB is only recommended for cases with a side panel window obviously, so you can see through it. Now that it's removed, I'm going to see what's inside this box. Okay, what they said in the uh, uh, what they said in the website, Amazon. I'll leave an Amazon link for it. Now here is the transformer or inverter, whatever you call it. And then, yeah, this will allow you to, oh, what's that? Whatever, but yeah, this will allow you to connect the RGBs. Here are the LED strips. One will go on the bottom and maybe one on the side. Here is an extension and here are some zip ties. And of course, here's the remote. This is for PCs that don't have any, you know, pre-installed RGB software where there's an RGB header on the computer. This is for the basic computer, what I have. So, um, this, after all, is the sensor for the signal. So I'm going to have to mount that somewhere, like, I don't know, maybe behind the plastic side panel, so I'm going to zip tie it here or something. Uh, but I also plan on installing a DVD drive, so I don't know if that will interfere with it, so. Time to get started. Uh, where's those RGBs? Here they are. So it's, it is a magnet, but it's also a double-sided tape. I think I should do this too. Ooh, is that hurting it? But it's kind of curled up, and I want it to be straight when mounting. Yeah, it is a magnet. Right, let's see if it will fit here. Yeah, it will. One of them fell over. Okay, so match up the arrows if you see. Let me zoom in on that. You see there are two arrows. Match those up because those are the correct circuits. So now, uh, I know you should do this, but I'm going to. I'm going to. Uh, plug it into the Molex cable and power up the computer while it's still open just to see where it'll light up the computer. But of course you should plug in the Molex cable because, uh, well, that's how you install it. Now, make sure your computer has one of these. Hang on. Does mine have any? Yeah, right here, this thing. You see that? That is a Molex connector. This will connect on this end. There we go. It's connected. Now I'm gonna quickly plug in my PC. Power on. Oh look, lights are already turning on. Is one strip enough? Nah, more RGB the better. Why is it so loud? <laughs> Whatever, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna make sure the sensor is correctly placed. This is, wait, blue, green, R. Uh, how do I have it? 
Ooh. That looks nice. Look at it. It's blue. That is... What? That's sort of purple. But that kind of looks blue when I press that. This is blue. A lot of colors are the same, basically. But just different shades. So when I power off the computer, lights turn off, obviously. So now it's time to mount everything where they belong. This is going to be the tough part. Right. I think I will just use the double-sided tape. Right. I'll unplug the LED strip. Put it aside. And unplug that as well. Yeah, there will be a lot of scratching noise, but... I might want to mount these with case screws instead. So, let me grab it. Yep, they mount right with case screws. Here, I guess. This is really hard to decide where I'll put it, so uh, I guess cue the time lapse because, yeah. turns on. It does. Uh, wait, hang on. I have forgot to plug in the RGB LEDs. Got the power cable. Wrap that down. And plug it in. That's much better. Very bright as well. Although that cable's a bit ugly. It's fine. Ah, uh, one day I'll fix up the cable management. Now that looks great. Should adjust the lighting. Take a look at that. Uh, it's showing too much of the lights actually. I kind of want to mount that out outer to here, you know. Yeah, I'll fix it up on my free time. What does this do? That flashes. Slowly transitions to colors, different colors. This also does the same thing. All right, yeah, looks good. I don't know what those do. Hmm. 
Yeah. So uh, that is how you install RGB LEDs in your computer. It looks so much better. Uh, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. All right, quick update, uh, guys. I know this is the end of the video, but whatever. But look, I have fixed it up. I've routed the other one to be here instead, and the other one just somewhere down there, down here, that part of the case. Uh, I've also put the little sensor there. I don't know if you can see that. I'll, I'll turn off my lights just for a second. Yeah, you see that? That's the sensor. It's back on. See? I figured it out. Uh, so it just takes some time and dedication. It will work. All this ugly box is still showing, but whatever. No one's going to look there. And the cable management is horrid. So that will be fixed up one day. So yeah. Uh, once again, thanks for watching. And I shall see you next time.